Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with another full case of the brand new release 2018 Panini Contenders Football 12 box. Pick your team number three from jazbeescasebreaks.com. On the 11th, pick your team three. Joe Kroll, Last Spot Mojo. All right, let's see. Let's see what we got here. Here's our contenders bingo card. We got two Mayfields. We haven't seen this guy yet. Maybe this is the break. Or maybe we'll see doubles of those other guys. You never know. Now, Andy, who has my Raiders, has a new show for me. Slobby's World? What is that? And I have not even caught up on... There's, there's, there's stacks of things I need to catch up on. So, what's, so sell me on it. What's, what's Slobby's World about? First box, good luck everyone. Lakers are down 95-79. Six minutes left in the fourth quarter. I don't think it's going to happen for them tonight. Oh, I see. He owns a store in Tucson and sells retro stuff from the 80s and 90s. Oh, so this is this is uh this is more like a reality show type thing. Like a Pawn Stars type reality show as opposed to like a sitcom or a drama or anything like that. What kind of stuff does he have? All right, let's see what kind of stuff we get out of here. Let's see what kind of stuff we have. Good luck, everyone. First thing is Joe Mixon to 175, playoff ticket. And these will randomize left and right at the end of the break. First autograph is rookie ticket autograph, Javon Wims. That is for the Bears. That'll be going to Matthew K. Next autograph is Micah Kaiser, rookie ticket autograph for the Rams. Uh, Michael N. with that one. Bengals autograph, rookie ticket auto, Billy Price. Scott V. with the Bengals. Harrison Phillips for the Bills. Lucas Snow with the Bills.
Vita Vea, rookie ticket autograph. Buccaneers. That'll be for Jay Tinney. And another Bears autograph, rookie ticket, cracked ice, 4 out of 24, on-card auto, Anthony Miller. Matthew K, nice one for the Bears. Bill Mosher, quick question. What, who, who do I have this weekend? I think that the I think the Colts are going to keep it close. So I'm taking Colts plus points. I think Rams are going to roll over the uh, Dallas Cowboys. Sorry, Wonka. I think that, I think Rams are going to crush. Um, I think Chargers plus the points, but New England will probably win it at the end. And. Um, Well, what's the what's the what's the last game? Oh, and I think the Saints are going to beat the uh, Saints are going to beat the Eagles. But do I take Eagles plus the points? I haven't decided that yet. But yeah, it's hard to go against Foles, right? That's the that's the trouble. That is definitely the trouble. All right. Well, to An yeah, to Andy, who's a who's a Cowboys fan, he thinks they're a slight favorite, but not according to Vegas. Any given Saturday, any given Sunday, anything can happen, right? You know, Todd Gurley and Jared Goff could get knocked out of the game on the first play, and then, you know, anything can happen. But I got to go with the what's most probable. Chase Litton, fake Patrick Mahomes. David Allison with the Chiefs. We got fake Tom Brady, Danny Etling, because they all kind of look like, oh, from there. You're thinking Saints Patriots Super Bowl? That seems that seems likely. It seems yeah. I mean, it seems like another Bears auto. Roquan Smith this time. Nice nice break for the Bears so far. Matthew K. Yeah, I feel like the Patriots could stumble their way into the playoffs or to the Super Bowl again, right? Can't beat that home field advantage. You know, they, they're rested up. They have a bye. There's Deron Payne to 95. Nice one for Patrick K and the Redskins. Any guesses on that redemption?
It's going to be Kike Kuti for Josh and the Texans. Nice. Next box. Yeah, Bill's saying the only caveat I have about the past make is how how bad is Andy Reid screw up tomorrow? Because they have, if Patriots have to go to Kansas City, I don't think I don't think they're gonna make they're gonna win. Yeah, Patriots have to keep their home field if they want to get it, and Andy Reid has to has to kind of kind of get over that uh, get that monkey off his back, you know. Great regular season coach, you know, definitely a great offensive mind, but but when it comes to crunch time. That defense could could betray them too. That defense has to keep the Colts quiet. Uh, Bill saying, I'm a massive Patriot fan, so we aren't that good. No, you guys are not that good. But yet, there there's many scenarios where, where the Patriots can can bump they can bumble their way into uh into the Super Bowl. Chargers in the snow. They've been playing so many road games, you know. They're exhausted. They just don't have enough gas to beat the Patriots. Patriots just run a lot, grind out the game, win at home. Somehow Andy Reid doesn't beat the Colts. Colts have to travel, go into New England. Patriots grind out another game. Championship ticket, Shaquem Griffin, not to 49. Nice one for the Seahawks, Ricky Holbert. Playoff ticket, Alex Smith to 175. They might have been able to make the playoffs if Alex Smith was healthy. And that's a live carry on Johnson autograph. 32 out of 49. I think most of the ones we've seen have been redemptions. Maybe the base autos are redemptions. That goes to Mike Cody and the Lions. There you go, Mike. And MJ Stewart for the Buccaneers. That'll be for Jay. Patrick Hay with the Redskins. Can, can I explain what determines if there is a live auto versus a sticker auto? How do, how do you mean? Like, how does the company determine who's a sticker and who's, an, who's a 
on card or a redemption versus an auto Utah drops confetti for a regular season game interesting Ah, why are so, why some are on card and why some are sticker? Generally speaking, they they usually have like the upper tier rookies tend to be on card, and then the next tier rookies tend to be stickers. Stickers is a with the high demand of auto autographs from us from consumers. Sticker autos have become stickers have become a fact of life in order to cut down on costs. Because it's too expensive to have every single thing be on card. So sometimes you have to resort to stickers. And they want to reduce as much, uh, you know, you want to reduce the number of redemptions in a product as much as possible. So, you know, do you want to wait on MJ Stewart to sign his cards? Or would you rather just slap on the sticker and just put the product in production? So there's, it's most, it's, you know, business reasons. But yeah, generally the value for the on-card tends to be Tends to be higher. Championship ticket autograph, 23 out of 49. Kimoku Ture. And a lot of times in some other products, you'll notice that patch autos, right? In some like mid-range or upper mid sets, patch autos also tend to be stickers because they manufacture and produce the patch first. And they don't have it in the hands of the people to, of the players to sign it on card. Rookie ticket autograph, Dylan Contrell. So uh, oftentimes you'll see relic autos have uh, be sticker autos. Now in higher end sets like Flawless and like National Treasures and stuff like that, most of those, almost all of those will be on card, even with the relic. Oh, what's this? Wow. We haven't seen one of these yet. 7 out of 10. Rookie ticket autograph. Mark Walton for the Bengals. Scott V with this acetate card. Pick your team three, Fins up. Nice. That was pretty cool. Braxton Berrios, rookie ticket autograph for the Patriots. That goes to Tom Richard. There's Kiko Alonso to 99. That goes to the Dolphins. That'll be for Anthony P. And rookie ticket autograph, Traverius McFadden. Niners, Victor Z. And playoff ticket autograph, Jalen Holmes to 99. Six autographs in this one. 
It's a bonus, uh, bonus in there. So Wonka Vader, going back to what you were talking about, that's why they'll start, uh, they'll start pitching, you know, start promoting the fact that hey, one of these will be on card too, as like a as a sales point. I think Bowman Baseball, like Bowman Draft, I think you'll see some stickers every once in a while for insert autos, but the main autographs are almost always on card. Usually, usually their ba the base autos are always on card, and then the insert autos are stickers. Oh, another, another thing, Wonka Vader, a lot of times you'll see veterans. So, like, old school guys, like, let's say Jimmy Graham, right? You know, a lot of times he, he might have binders of – they might have, have uh, binders of stickers. Um uh, available for Jimmy Graham so they can put him into products without sending a stack of cards to Jimmy Graham being like, hey, Jimmy Graham, can you sign these cards? A lot, as the, the veteran players tend to uh, tend not to want to sign as much. And they may be, they're, 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 there may be players under different contracts too. At the higher levels, you know, Brady can charge... 500 bucks an autograph or something like that, right? So so whether it's sticker or on card, there you know, Panini's not going to be throwing a Brady in every other box, you know what I mean? It would just be way too expensive. Maui started opening packs at 3 o'clock Pacific, 6 o'clock Eastern. There's Marcus Baugh for the Raiders. Well, Tom Brady also, Bill, he also charges like 500 bucks an autograph, right? Jalen Holmes, you know... Traverius McFadden, they're probably getting paid a dollar an autograph. So you can start working out the the economics there. I actually don't know if Brady, if there's a Brady auto in this checklist. Does anybody know offhand? Got Jordan Lasley, rookie ticket autograph for the Purple Birds, Jerry Bennington. And Denzel Ward, rookie ticket autograph. Ah, Finn's up is saying there's, there is an out of 10 Brady autograph in here. Somewhere. Maybe, maybe in this stack right here. Zach Ertz, 99. Yeah, we have, we'll have time for high tech after this. I think there's only six left, right? Oh, still at six? We should finish that off. We'll have this break done in about another 35 minutes or so. So that should bring us... No, no, no. We got time for that, Gavin. We should finish that off. But we should have it finished by the, by the end of this break. Just to get it, just to get it in the on, on the schedule ASAP. Because we'll have this. I'll be ready to do that break. Pretty much after this one. So around. Actually, yeah, that could be our last break of the night. Actually. Because we'll have this, by the time I get this break done and then all the stuff randomized and the stuff put away and all that, that should take us to around, that's for the Chiefs, that should take us to around 10.30 Pacific, maybe just a little bit before then, but around there. 
and then we can fill up that uh, fill up that uh, tech by then, and then we can do it, and that'll bring us to the end of the night. Dante Pettis. That's uh, Niners, right? I don't know why I'm blanking on where Dante Pettis goes. It's been a long night. It is a 49er. That goes to Victor Z. There you go. A gold miner. All right, next box. Um, sorry, Bill, I missed your question from earlier. It's a weird. You're a huge Mookie Vets fan. He doesn't have a ton of cards, but if you go to a game, he'll sign anything you ask. Yes, and, and, and to answer your current question, too, the, do you know of any players just opted out of signing? Yeah, there are plenty of players that just don't want to sign. Michael Gutierrez, send link NFL. I'm not sure... NFL.com? I don't know what you mean. Um, but yeah, there. I mean, there are many players who... This is why when, when, when people are like, Oh, come on, Panini. How come there's no so-and-so in this set? You know what I mean? When, when, they, when you do that, a lot of times it's just players... <laughs> Bill. A lot of times it's just players being like, Eh, don't want to do it. It's just not worth it for them. Oh, to get into football breaks, just go to the website right above my head, jazbeescasebreaks.com, with any browser. There you go, Rory. There he is. Just watch the Dominion basketball break. You are welcome. I guess you just have to not watch breaks live, Rory, and then you'll start hitting. You got that triple, too. Aaron Crager was in disbelief. He had because he had two out of the three. There's Sam Hubbard. Well, this was the story Richard L was talking about earlier, right? About how he threw his mouthpiece into the stands. That goes to Scott and the Bengals. Deontay Burnett for the Seahawks. That'll be for Ricky Holbert. Harrison Phillips, another Bill. Another Harrison Phillips for Lucas. Well, well, Rory, maybe you should go out to dinner for your friend's birthday more often. But but join breaks. Maybe that's the mojo. That's that's the that's the that's the, that's the combination there. Whoa. Wow. Ten out of twenty contenders to Canton. This old contenders card to Canton. On card autograph for Michael Nepp and the Rams. Did not expect that. That's really cool. Nineteen ninety nine contenders. Wow. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I like I, li I like that design. I was a didn't realize they had those in there. Yeah, no worries, Michael. That's a nice hit. We got more legendary contenders. How about Lawrence Taylor? Two out of ten. New York football giants, Juan Pena.
two legends back to back. There's Marlon Mack to 175. There you go. Five autographs, two legends. Maybe three future legends. So which one of these three will be as legendary as these two? Oh yeah, Roar, we also pulled that pulled that uh an acetate card, a clear card. I didn't realize that was in there either. That was a surprise. It was Mark Walton, I think. Bangle. Alright, no worries, Rory. I'll see ya. Yeah, Brent, I agree. There are some cool surprises in this. In previous years, it's been strictly rookies and like these vet autos were extremely harder to find. But I think that uh I think they start to sprinkle in a little more vets in this contenders this year, which is nice. Not too much, but not too little, enough to like see every once in a while, you know? Maybe every other case, we'll see guys like that, which I think is cool. I kind of like that too. At first I thought it was a, it was a, it wasn't, I did, you can, you can tell I did a lot of research on this. Um, but like the ones with like the jagged edge, like a ripped stub or some, like car, like ticket stub or something like that. Originally I was like, is that intentional? Is that an error? And then Rich Schmidt was like, I oh, know, yeah, those those are those are those are new this year. I thought they looked pretty cool too. They're numbered to their jersey number. Yeah, I thought I thought it was me. No, I thought because there's the there are the uh, the crimping machines that crimp the the packs right here, and I thought maybe the crimping machine got to it. Send it back. Tell Panini, hey, the crimping machine got it. And I'll be like, no, no, bro, do your research, Joe. You gotta do your research, man. Russell Wilson MVP contender 75. All right, Rory, I'll see you. Have a good night, man. Congrats again on that Giannis. I was about to say we hadn't seen points yet, but there it is. I jinxed it in my head. Tanner Lee, rookie ticket autograph with the Jags, Robert Aguilar. Michael, are you a, are you a local? Yeah, well you you can pick up. We're we're open during business hours. Open to the public. Just email us jaspiescasebreaks at gmail .com, and you can arrange that with our with our customer service team. Playoff ticket autograph. DJ Reed, twenty nine out of ninety nine. Oh, nice. You're in L. A. Whereabouts? We're in Redondo Beach, so I don't know if that's a, if, that, if that's going to be a hike for you or not. But, but yeah, you are welcome to pick up if you'd like. We got Chase Edmonds. Oh, that was the connection, Gavin. Yeah, the Dominion basketball. We had that triple auto. That triple auto, um, we're all uh, no Villanova guys. I didn't realize that. Ooh, cracked ice always looks nice. One out of twenty-four. Corey Littleton. Oh, you're in. San I'm in Santa Monica. I'll just drop it off, Michael. 
just drive by. It'd be like a drug deal. Just come out to the car, take a ride around the block. Here's your Kurt Warner, man. Thanks. Liam Hines. Nice on-card auto. Rookie ticket on-card auto for the Colts. Dane Reynolds. Next box. We're getting there, ladies and gentlemen. We're getting there. I see a couple of orders coming in. I don't know what it's for. I think we're a little too late. I don't see a lot of teams moving in that contenders for. So we, we may have to roll that till tomorrow. But we should still be able to do... Oh, High Tech 2 is sold out. So that will happen right after this. And then I think we'll call it a night after that. I think we had a pretty pretty busy night. And then we'll reconvene tomorrow. We break seven nights a week, folks. We'll reconvene tomorrow, and we'll break more contenders. We'll do another three cases. Three or four, maybe four. Maybe we'll do four cases tomorrow night. Squeeze in some Dominion as well. By then, we would have done a little bit of everything. Football, baseball, basketball with that high tech to close out the night. All right. Good luck, boys and girls. Here we go. Redemption. Come on, Panini. That, that's definitely intentional. That goes to Tom Richard and the Patriots. Out of 175. They did that on purpose. They totally did that on purpose. And it got me too. Wonka Vader got me too. I was like, oh, autograph? Nope. This is a nice auto though. Out of 24, Mike McGlinchey, rookie ticket, cracked ice autograph for Victor Z and the Niners. Rookie ticket on card auto, James Washington. Steelers, that'll be for Michael Gallucci. Rookie ticket autograph, Jake Kumro. Jeremy Scott, Packers. Got Rod Smith, rookie ticket autograph for the Cowboys, James. See what we got here. Good luck, everybody. 
It's Derwin James rookie ticket autograph. Tyler with the Chargers. Great rookie defensive back for the Bolts. Next box. Winner take all on the points. Playoff ticket, Deshaun Watson to 175. Wasn't fooled this time. Where are all the autos? Are they all in here? Oh, there it is. DJ Reed, rookie ticket autograph for the Niners, Victor Z. From Oregon State, Ryan Nall, rookie ticket autograph for the Bears, Matthew K. Championship ticket auto to 49. Christopher Hernan, the fourth, Jets. That'll be for Stacy. DJ Left Shark, rookie ticket autograph. Jaguars, Robert Aguilar. Sorry for the Amari Cooper hands there. We got a nice rubbery mat right here, protects it. Oh, and then the points would, would have been the fifth autograph, so there you go. Three boxes to go, we're almost there. Good luck, ladies and gents. We are getting close to the end of the night. After this break, we got one more. Tops High Tech Baseball. I think we're going to shut it down after that. The Big Hit Express. I'm running running out of steam, boys and girls. These long breaks. But we had a great night. We'll be back tomorrow. 
sure to watch. Uh, I'll have my football take. If you have the suggested breaks, uh, Google document, Google sheet saved. You'll see my picks at some point late tonight. So keep an eye out there if I remember to update it. So be sure to check that out. And we'll be watching the last half of the first game tomorrow together. And then we'll be watching the, what's the what's the late game? Oh, the late game is uh, Cowboys-Rams. So if you don't want to listen to Joe Buck, and uh, if you don't listen to Joe Buck and Troy Aikman, you can always listen to, you can put it on mute and listen to Joe Jaspi. Yelling at the TV, wondering why he put so much money on Team X or Y. And they're losing. <laughs> Playoff ticket to 175. Leonard Fournette, Jaguars. Playoffs. And we got Javon Wims. That's for the Bears, uh, Matthew K. And we got Durham Smythe, championship ticket, autographed, 49 for the Dolphins. That goes to Anthony P. And Brandon Powell, 23 out of 99, playoff ticket. That's for the Lions, Mike Cody with the Lions. That's the first Brandon Powell auto we've seen here. Corey Littleton, championship ticket to 49. And there's your on card, another Mark Walton. For uh, Benning? No. Scott. Sorry, I'm used to seeing Jerry Bennington's name with the Bengals, Scott. That one's for you, as well as all the other ones. I haven't seen any of these serial numbered. Usually we see a couple of those in the break. None yet. We're almost done. All right, final two boxes. Good luck. Cody West, what's going on? A little late to the party, that's all right. Better late than never. We've been pretty busy today, Cody. We've been doing all these breaks. I think we're all we're I think we're all running out of a little running out of steam a little bit.
Josh Allen. Rookie ticket on card autograph. Nice. Lucas Snow and the Bills. There you go. Still haven't seen Saquon. Might not get bingo tonight, folks. I'm hoping. Got like nine autos to go, right? Five in each box. There's Austin Prohl. Titans. Nice. I like those red, white, and blue parallels. No, that's not Saquon. That's Deontay Burnett. That goes to the Jets, though. Stacy, there you go, Stace. Just trying to fill out my bingo card, Stacy. Oh, that's not it either. That's a hit for hit for uh, the Bears, though, Matthew. Does not look like uh, Saquon Barkley as well. But this looks like a hit for Joe Kroll, Eagles. Got to fill out that bingo card, Joe. This is the, the, the massive Australian. Look at that. 6'8", 346. Tom Brady to 75, MVP contenders, and last box coming up. All right, good luck, ladies and gentlemen. Final box, we did it, we made it. We are we are on schedule too. This, this break is no longer or no faster than the other contenders we have done. So thanks for hanging with us. Cody West, now that you're here, who do you have? Who do you? What's your opinion? Who do you have on the football tomorrow? Who are you on? Who are you off? Uh, you got Colts at Chiefs early early game. You'll be able to catch that with me tomorrow, the end of that game tomorrow. And then the night game is uh, Cowboys at Rams. We got DeMond Patterson to 99. Playoff ticket autograph for Michael Gallucci and the Steelers. Colts beat the the Texans to get to where they needed to be. And the Cowboys held off uh, a late attack by the Seahawks to advance. You're going to go Colts and then Cowboys. Interesting. That Richie James going to Victor and the Niners. Speaking of the Cowboys, there they are. There's Dorrance Armstrong Jr., I don't know. I feel like I feel like the Cowboys have been a little inconsistent. 
It took a it took a crazy Cole Beasley play to get that win. A great throw from Dak though. There's Jared Goff. Speaking of the Rams, he'll face this guy too. Although they've actually been playing well with that guy being limited, Sean Lee being limited. Goff will go to Michael. Yeah, the Cowboys defense is definitely is definitely the scary one. They kind of let Russell Wilson back in the game, but here's the thing. I like the pieces of the Cowboys, but not not really a fan of Jason Garrett. I feel like I feel like Jason Garrett often gets a little too conservative with uh with his weapons, and he's got some great weapons too. And then he he lets like Russell Wilson do Russell Wilson things. Baker Mayfield. We got Josh Allen in the previous box, closing out with Baker Mayfield on card auto in this box. Thomas Howell had to wait to the very end. Nice. The butcher, the baker, the candlestick maker. What do do we just tear off Baker Mayfield? Or we just stop that. Put a check mark next to his name. Saquon? No, no Saquon at the end. That would have, what a box Baker made from the Saquon Barkley. Sam Hubbard going to Scott and the Bengals. Mike Cody says Chiefs and Saints. Will advance. Rams will advance as well. What about you got you're missing a game? Chargers. Chargers Patriots, Mike Cody. Dennis says Dnip says Rams. And there you go, folks. Nice break. I don't think I saw any serial numbered one of these, but if we if we find them, we'll we'll figure it out. All right. Let's do left, right randomizer and winner take all on the points. All right, four and a one, five times for each list. One, two, three, four, and a one, five times. Left side, we'll get them. So all the left sides, we'll get those. And four and a one, five times for the 500 points. One, two, three, four. And fifth and final time. After five times, we've got Victor Z. There you go, Victor. Nice break for you and the Niners and the bonus points as well. There you have it, folks. Whew, we made it. Pick, pick your team three in the books. Contenders football, some great stuff. I'm sure we'll do a few more tomorrow. So buy your teams now. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Bye-bye.